Hi everybody, Cheaply Chic, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing some friend mail, some very long overdue friend mail. And Rhonda, I am so sorry about that, but I am so appreciative and I'm so thankful and I don't ever want anyone to feel like I'm not when I run behind. So I'm super excited to open these today and share them with all of you and finally get to open them. They've been sitting here and I've been, oh my gosh, Lynette. So Rhonda has sent me a few packages over the last few months. So I'm going to open those in the order that I received them. And I said, okay, I'll go by the date. Well, then I saw that it's literally the end of October and <laughs> Rhonda, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry it's been so long. Okay, so this is the first package and I literally just cut it open. I hadn't peeked at this before, but oh my goodness, you guys. Look at, look at this. She had told me, I had messaged her last week or two weeks ago about this mail and she had told me that she had made me some pink doilies that would go great with the ephemera packs that I just released, but I hadn't had time to film this video, but I knew that they would work out in a future collection that will be coming up in a few months too. So definitely pink is something that comes up often for me. So yay, you guys. How exciting is this? Oh my gosh. She has so many. Rhonda, thank you. Oh my goodness. These are amazing. Oh my goodness. These are pretty and she just sent me a big bag full of doilies. Rhonda, thank you so much. These are so much fun. Oh my goodness. So there is blue and white ones in here. Lots of this really pretty brown, which quite honestly, these will, these will probably work out in the next collection in March's collection that I'm getting started on right now. And look at these really pretty rosy colors. Color, I should say. Those are so pretty. Oh my goodness. I'm, I don't know. I might use them in my journal. And then this really soft pink color. And there's just so many, Rhonda. Thank you so much. Really, thank you so much. I love these. And you must really enjoy sitting and doing these when you're, like I can imagine you doing this like when you're watching TV or something. Maybe I'm wrong, but that's what I imagine. And I love these so much. Thank you so much for sharing those with me. And then you guys, I have two of these shoe box sizes boxes from Rhonda. And this one was from the end of October as well. And I just cut this box open yesterday and I picked the right end. The card is on the top. So because of the height of this box, I'm just going to pull it out and share with you guys. First, she sent me this card. I'm going to read this really quick. <laughs> Thank you so much, Rhonda. She said that there's a lady at her church that's sharing things with her mom and they're passing on the love and sharing it with me. So look, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Burlap, first of all, you guys know if you watch my channel, I love burlap and this is fabulous because it's already in a ribbon size. Oh my gosh, that is like perfect. Usually I'm going through a giant sheet of burlap to cut the little pieces. This is awesome. Thank you so much, Rhonda. That is a huge blessing and I'm super excited. Ooh, <laughs> I'm super excited about this too because I do love this. This was the first year that I had actually gotten my hand on a couple of these at the Dollar Tree. So this will definitely come in handy. This is so awesome of a texture to use on your pages and stuff. Thank you so much for that. Oh my goodness. And there's more burlap in here. So excited about that. And you guys look at this really pretty lace. I love that color splash. So on here, they're showing how you can, you know, color it. But I remember when they had this line of stuff, wasn't it like one of those summery lines? I don't know. I could be wrong, but that's beautiful lace. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. Oh, seam binding galore, you guys. Oh my goodness. Look at this adorable bag, first of all. I love that. 
You know I'm going to use that. I'm putting it in my book. Oh, yay. Oh, my gosh. Oh, oh my goodness. These are beautiful. And oh, my gosh. Actually, I wanted to craft today and make a few things that these are going to be so perfect for. Like, there is no other perfect day than today for these. I love these. Look at that shabby mix there. Oh my goodness. These are going to be so much fun. Look at those. Rhonda, thank you so much. Oh my gosh. I love these. Thank you so, so much. Those are going to be so fun. And then you guys, oh my goodness. I got to try to keep this video at a certain level. I am so far behind. So far behind. These are fabulous. Look at that really pretty red color. And then some blanket binding, silky stuff. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited. There is this really fun trim here. I love, love, love these trims. And I love the packaging and the labels to use in journals and journaling cards and stuff. I don't get to it yet, but I always plan on it. <laughs> it's going to happen. They're going to happen. Hem facing. Then this really cute little blue trim. Oh, and that's a, re a really pretty yellow. Perfect for spring. Some black trim. And then look at these. Oh my goodness. These are so cute. Like, I know that this, I know that I, you know, am really behind on this, but so much of this stuff I'm pulling out right now is perfect for what I want to start. You know, I have a couple days here where I really should start filming in the collection, but I just need a minute <laughs> to do something fun and different that I have on my heart to do. So I'm super excited about some of this stuff I'm pulling out of here. These are adorable. I love these little things. Oh my goodness. And then some little pearls. Those are wonderful. So those are fun. And then this really pretty red velvet trim here. Oh my goodness. And there's still more, you guys. Thank you so much, Rhonda. And then a little bag of goodness. This has a bunch of little seam bindings and trims in it. These are just the best bags, aren't they? When you find these kind of bags, like at the thrift store or something. And the little cutoff of that lace right there. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited, Rhonda. Thank you so much. There is some red trim. There's like, I think it's elastic. There's some elastic on here. It's great. Some more blanket trim stuff. Oh, this is fun. Some more like gauze material that's great for texture and stuff on our projects. So excited. And then there is some larger trims in here. Stick to trim. These are fun. They're like sticker trims. Oh, cool. I love, I always love the packaging and I get sucked into that packaging. But these are super cute and it's just gold sticky trim. Those are great. Thank you so much. And then you guys, oh my gosh, this is like my world right here. Oh, oh my gosh. I am seeing into this box. Oh my goodness. This is fabulous. Rhonda, thank you so much. You guys, you guys know that I tie up my journals with seam binding every month and this could not be, I mean, this is a fantastic thing for me. Thank you so much. Look at this adorable <laughs> ad label. Oh my gosh. I love it. And this really pretty purple color. That is so great. And then she shared this yellow one with me, this red one. Oh my gosh. And they're full. Rhonda, thank you so much. And this great navy blue color. Oh, this is like one of my favorite colors right here. This orange color. And then another full navy blue. Rhonda, thank you from the bottom of my heart. I am, I'm serious. I just, 
I can't even express how much I appreciate <laughs> this so much. Thank you so, so much. All right, you guys, I have one more box, so I'm going to keep moving. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I forgot. I forgot. There's this exciting thing in here. Oh, my gosh. They're buttons. First of all, in the very bottom, there's a little more seam binding, and it's this pale blue color that is beautiful. I love that. And you guys, another type of awesome bag, right? Like a bag of buttons. There's not many things that are better than going through a bag of old buttons, Rhonda. Thank you so much. I'm going to have fun with those, using them and looking through them. So I appreciate that so very much. Thank you. And then, you guys, I have one more of those nailing boxes. It, like, reminds me of, like, a shoebox size. And I popped this one open, too, and she sent me this one around Christmas. Oh, it's just full of gloriousness. Look, more, more doilies. And I'm definitely going to share these with you guys in a collection. Man, you know what? Probably with... Do with um, Rhonda's doilies that I hoard, I might actually have enough to share in a collection. So we're going to have to see. But look at these. These are beautiful. I love that yarn. There. I love that chunky yarn. That is so pretty. I love them, Rhonda. Thank you so much. And then you guys, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I'm going to pull out, oh, there's a present in there. So these are some things that she has in there. Some white Rick Rack, which I love Rick Rack. It's so one of my favorite things. And this little package of needles, which again, how adorable is that? And the needles will be super useful too, you guys. I have been looking around my craft room for little needles. I have a lot of big needles and I'm like, I needed a little needle the other day and I couldn't find one, so thank you. This gold thread, oh my gosh. I couldn't find this either, so thank you so much. And look at that beautiful girl back there. Oh, and I'll tear her up if I take that off. I love that though. And then these little hooks, eye hooks and loops, which is awesome. And look, this really pretty trim. Always love. Thank you so much. Some white seam binding and oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Look at this. Little needle book. Oh my goodness. I love it. I love that so much. Oops. And then some, I'm <laughs> throwing needles, throwing needles around. And then that really pretty adver yeah image on the back oh, I love it some black buttons and then you guys I <laughs> love these so much I love these I love them using it like an embellishment like on the so crafty journal I had done that and that was just so much fun love it and then oh, Another little needle book. And how fun is that? That is from Philip 66. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. Thank you so much, Rhonda. And then some brown buttons. And oh my goodness. That is amazing. That is so amazing. Thank you so much. Wow. And look at that. They're like all there. Oh my goodness, Rhonda. Thank you so much. And then this chain thing. <laughs> Coat and jacket hangers. Ah, very cool. I love that. Of course, I can use the chain for other things, but how cool is that? So cool. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. And you guys, there's other, oh, there's a card. I should probably read the card first. I'll read the card before I go any further. Merry Christmas, Lynette. Oh my goodness. I am so excited and this is so sweet, Rhonda. Thank you so, so much. I am, um, oh my gosh, I'm so excited, you guys. I like, I feel like I cheated reading this card because she told me that she made me a mini album and it is her first one that she ever made. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. I am so excited. Look at this. 
though. Oh my goodness. This is amazing, Rhonda. Oh my gosh. I just can't even right now. First of all, more fun buttons and button cards, but oh my goodness. That is adorable. It's like a little matchbook, but it has thread and needles. Oh, that is so cute. And you, oh, stop it. How adorable is that? Oh my goodness. These buttons are fantastic. But you guys, look at this bling. Oh my goodness. These are fabulous. And little buckles. And they have that like tarnished look, which is so fantastic. And they're all a little different. Wow, Rhonda. <laughs> Thank you so, so much. These are so awesome. I am so excited about these. I just love these so much. Wow. I love the little tags too. <laughs> I love the little tags. Oh my gosh. These are fabulous. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It's so overwhelming. And here is the pink doilies that I know she was talking about for the collection. Oh, they're so beautiful. These are going to be so lovely. And yes, I will definitely share them in an ephemera pack. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Thank you so much. I just, I am so in love with these. Thank you so very much. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, you guys, a few more things and then I get to open her package. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, and then there's a little package of needles still floating around in here. Oh my goodness. These are going to be so awesome too. Wrapping paper. Oh, oh my gosh. How adorable. <laughs> I love this. That's so cute. Thank you so much. And there is three packages here. I will be able to use this. And there's like little tags. Thank you so much. And then look at this one. How fun is that? All these little vintage ads with some tags again. I love that, Rhonda. Thank you so much. And you guys, oh my gosh, I'm so excited right now. Oh my goodness. Rhonda had told me she made me something for Christmas and I had thought, I don't know. But this was not what I expected, and I am so excited. And you guys, it's so heavy. Oh my goodness. And she told me to, let me see. She said she followed a tutorial by Faithful Designs by Christy on YouTube. So I will look for her channel and share it in the description box down below. I'm so excited. Okay, so excited. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. Oh my gosh. First of all, I have to tell you guys, I love the weight of this. I love the weight, oh my gosh. And it's beautiful, look at this. She has all this beautiful lace layers here. She said in her card, she's sorry about the glue. I don't see any glue, girl. <laughs> and look at these layered. I think she did all of the individual petals, the little center, the little beads. Oh my goodness, it is so beautiful. And it has sweet memories up here with this really cute frame and these butterflies that look very real. And look at these gorgeous rose gold leaves. I love that. And of course, the background dies. Love the flourishes always. And this beautiful pink flower right in the center with some bling. Oh, and these photo corners. And that beautiful paper that looks like Prima. I don't know if it is, but oh goodness. It's so pretty. I love that. 
I love that. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm sorry, you guys. Oh my gosh, I'm looking really quickly. This is so beautiful. Oh my goodness. All right, I am definitely going through this. First of all, I just whipped open that bow that was so perfect. I'm never going to get it that way again. There's this little blip thing she did here. This is so fantastic. I love this. Pull out white tag first to unlock the page. So fun. So a beautiful journaling card. Everything is so perfection. Oh my goodness. This is fabulous, Rhonda. This is amazing. That is awesome. That is a fun little pocket right there. Wow, I am in love with that. That is so cool. And this paper is just gorgeous. And all of her die cuts that she used and cut. Oh my goodness. And I just love these little cards. This is so pretty. I love this. And she added some lace down the center there. And look at this fun page. And that gorgeous paper. You're going to have to tell me what paper this is because I love this. How fun is this page? Oh my goodness. Wow. This is going... I'm going to have to do something like, I don't know, pictures of my daughters and my mom, like, you know, the generational female <laughs> side of my family, right? Like, this is so feminine and beautiful. More lace in the center, and then she has another one of these pockets. All of your cuts, and I mean, it is just perfection. So she has like this envelope pocket here that is gorgeous with another journaling card. And this paper though, I am telling you, look at how beautiful. Everything is just foiled and gorgeous. And then I think this is the center. I'm almost to the center. More of her beautiful die cuts, her adorable bow. There is a slide card in here again. So you have to pull out the card first to open, right? Or no, no, no. Oh, yes. Oh, my gosh. This is adorable. Like, stop. Look how cute that is. Oh, my gosh. I am in love. I'm going to tie that later. I am so in love with this. This is amazing. So then here's the center of the album and we have this great pocket again. This is so pretty, Rhonda. I just, I'm in awe. Oh, how fun. I love the double pocket, the journaling or the photo album pages. Oh my gosh. I love this. Look at that little bird. She fussy cut. And the little butterflies. That is so beautiful. Oh my goodness. Double pockets. Another, um, another very interactive page here. Oh my goodness. This is fantastic. There's a, oh, look at her little perfect bow. Oh my gosh. And that slides out. I don't want to pull it out and mess it up. And then there's a couple more spots there. There is a spot here. This is so inspiring. I'm going to have to um, play around with some of these ideas. This is fantastic. I love this beautiful, beautiful die cut you have. And then you guys, wow. This, look at this little waterfall here. I love it. And then the back. Another little pocket in that paper. Oh my goodness. And then she has this little thing here. I never saw any glue, Rhonda. <laughs> 
look at this. It's beautiful. So you can add a bunch of papers there. And then another little tag up here. This is stunning. Like, I can't believe the perfection. See, look, I'm, <laughs> I'm going to have to fix that. I'm going to have to concentrate and fix that in a minute. This is so fantastic. Rhonda, I am so in love with this. Thank you so much. And the weight of it. I love this. Rhonda, I just can't even. I just can't even. This is going to be treasured. Like, I don't even know when it would stop being treasured because of how I'm going to use it and how I'm going to. The photos. The photos of my grandmothers and mother and daughters. It's just going to be a treasure. I already know it. So thank you so, so much. I appreciate this so much and that you shared it with me and that it was your first one. Oh my goodness. I just, I love it so much. And thank you for everything else. Like, thank you for all of the little bits and pieces and the seam binding and your handmade doilies that are precious and priceless to me because I know the love and time that things like that take. I just... Thank you so much, like from the bottom of my heart. And I do apologize. I will, <laughs> I'm going to send you a message before I post this video. So I will um, talk to you about all of that. But thank you from the bottom of my heart. And I just appreciate you and the joy that you send me and the love that you share with me. I just appreciate you so much. So thank you so, so much. And you guys, I also have a couple other things to share. Back when I had COVID, I just want to mention this, and I did not share this on video because I was sick. And <laughs> my friend Kim, Creative Crafticality, she's part of my design team. She blesses me with that. But when I had COVID, she sent me a package, and on it, it had said, like, it had said something about, I knew it was for that moment. Like, it was to make me feel better. It was like a surprise, um, feel better meal or something. It was something to that. That was not what she said, but it was something like that. So I'm like, you know what? I'm super sick. I'm not feeling well. I am going to open this and enjoy it right now. Like just for me, you know? So I had messaged Kim about it and everything, but what she did was she had sent me a care package slash happy mail. And it was like Christmas. She sent me a candle, a blanket. She sent me so many great, awesome things that I was able to enjoy during the Christmas season. And it really did just brighten my day when I was feeling miserable. <laughs> so Kim, once again, I just want to say thank you so much for that giant thoughtfulness because it was so thoughtful and it was such a blessing to me. And I just appreciate that so very much. And I did very much enjoy all of the goodies that you sent for the holiday season. So thank you so very much for that. That was so kind. And then you guys, I got one Christmas card I from Karina. Karina, thank you so much. I appreciated this so very much. And then you guys, I got a package from Dawn. Dawn had messaged me a while back too, like in November. Dawn, I'm so sorry. I knew this was coming and she was sharing with me. She said, look at first, I had to share this with you guys because of how adorable she wrapped this. And look at this packaging. Like, this is fabulous. She took the time and made it all beautiful. Like, I just love this. And they stuck their sticker right on top of it. I wonder if I can get that off without tearing it up. So I can put it in my book. Like, couldn't you put it on the back, people? Anyway, I'm going to have to work on that. <laughs> but this is adorable. Dawn, thank you so much. So she has this little, like, sticker piece here. And this tissue that I don't want to tear. Spring is coming, right, guys? Right? Right? It's right around the corner. <laughs> it really is. Time goes so fast anymore. I'm sure it really is. And we have some things going on in life where we're trying to do a lot to our house quickly. And I'll just be able to talk about that more at a later date. But then you guys will understand. 
Oh my goodness, it's so cute. So she told me she was sending me some of these because she had so many. Thank you, Dawn, because she knows that it's just helpful that I go, I use these in my kits and things. So I appreciate it so much. Thank you so much. And she just tied some cute baker's twine around there and shared those cards with me. Thank you so much, Dawn. I truly do appreciate that very much. And you guys, that is everything. And sometimes I do just feel so behind sharing these videos with you guys and getting into packages. But I do want you guys to know, Rhonda, I want you to know that I do appreciate you all so very much. And it, it is a, it is such an, uh, like there's something about the fact that you would think of me and you would bless me in this way when I'm just me. <laughs> So I just appreciate you guys so much. Thank you so much. And thank you to everyone who watched this video because I know that it's really the core group of my channel that watch videos like this. So I just want all of you to know how much I do very much appreciate you and being part of what I do and my channel and all of that. Just being part of my life. Like you're part of my life and I appreciate you all so very much. So thank you from the bottom of my heart and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.